हेलो व्यूअर्स अस्सलाम वालेकुम माय डियर फ्रेंड्स व्यूअर्स दिस इज माय 84th सेशन इन कंटिन्यूएशन टू लास्ट सेशन व्हिच वाज 83 सेशन इन व्हिच आई डिस्कस्ड about the ninth and tenth session sorry tenth chapter ninth and tenth chapter of the book which i read international finance and trade authored by or written by mr rajder watson the very learned man so mr watson was attached with the ib institute of banker uk and okay this last chapter second last the chunk control and tenth chapter is international funding and financing you can see this last chapter of the book friends we have discussed all the book all the chapter of the book and material of the book i discussed with you people in the last one and a half year or two years time starting from chapter number 1 for this chapter the last session i could not complete the video due to some net error so i will complete this chapter or complete the foundation session and before jumping this second topic of my life i am sorry of my professional life forty three years that is customer services or relationship with the customer attention welcoming to customers which is the backbone of the banking industry therefore now i discuss the chapter 9 in the book is exchange control the exchange control act 1947 therefore still the statute book the new exchange control regulation could be introduced at any time and with immediate effect this has been written in the book the outline of exchange control the united kingdom is a major manufacturing and trading nation and successive governments over the year have been aware of the importance of ensuring that any regulation introduced to do impact adversely upon our trading relationship the general policy in the post was to limit the outlay outflow of capital and to regulate any other factor which could have a direct 
or indirect impact upon the foreign exchange. Foreign exchange reserve in the UK or the value of the sterling in the terms of the other countries. The same formula because this is the book has been written in the scenario of their own UK the requirement and their trading and their exchange reserve and the UK bank, London bank, they are in. But in Pakistan, in Pakistan, we have to follow state bank regulation, the same pattern state bank adopted the exchange control. The state exchange control by State Bank of Pakistan, Ministry of Finance and Chamber of Commerce. Sorry. Ministry of Commerce. They are the main player to control the exchange or to regulate the all foreign exchange regulation implemented through State Bank of Pakistan. And every country has its own central bank. They regulate the exchange control and their effectiveness, abolition in the country. Here is the ninth chapter. Okay. The time is very limited. The video will take some more time. You people to impart information or share information about foreign exchange. Now, the chapter number 10 says international funding and financing. A distinction may be drawn between the finance of working capital for trading purpose described in the previous chapter and the longer term finance required by companies for major project or for capital purpose, the permanent equity or issued share or the long term loan stock of the company and liabilities are required as a funding base for fixed asset such as long term investment and major project undertaking undertaken by the company. With the exception of ECGD, backed facilities, export credit guarantee, development, backed by facilities described in chapter number 6, the chapter cover various aspects of the euro currency and finance and provided. Gentlemen and the viewers, the international funding is based on the foreign exchange, import and export, and their real terminology, bond, bullets, call, all the if security is registered, certificate of deposit, co-manager, and the consignment and confirmation, convertible bond, cost of fund, coupon, debenture, and all the this following thing this is the chapter chapter number 9 of 10th going to be finished and I will inshallah I will review from time to time in the foreign exchange session whatever you learned or you may ask me through email or whatsapp number you, you can find in my, in my channel by email you can ask or you can comment box question I will try to satisfy you okay this is the 84th session about foreign exchange ending of the session of foreign exchange all you learned from in 117 videos given and 
shared everything about import, export, documentary bill, bill of reading, bill of exchange and many other things discussed in the session which is going to be ended in this chapter. Okay. Thank you very much. So nice of you. Please subscribe me. आप हजरा से गुजारिश है कि आप देखें इसको और ट्रांसलेट करें और जाने बैंकिंग में क्या कुछ होता है फॉरन एक्सचेंज में और फिर भी मैं आप लोगों की मदद के लिए हाजिर हूँ यहाँ आपको बताता रहूँगा थैंक यू वेरी मच सो नाइस ऑफ यू